Welcome to Let's Build a Willy's Jeep. We are now working on the wiring system on our Willy's Jeep here, and this will be how to install your right side harness. And this will, will be the harness that will be behind your dashboard here. And we'll just go over what these wires connect to, and then we'll get to connecting them. Looking at the diagram provided by Wax Four Wheel Drive Parts, we'll start at number one. This is the red, three white tracers, and this is the lamp switch current breaker outside terminal. And number one will be this terminal. And now moving up the wire to number two is the only wire that has this kind of connection where the two wires connect together. And number two is your red three right tracers and it's the amp meter left terminal now moving to number three is your black three white tracers and this is the amp meter right terminal and this right here is your three tracers and this will connect to your amp and now number four is your black two white tracers here's your ignition switch coil or ignition terminal. Now moving down the wire to number five, this is your black three white tracers, starter switch, batter, battery side. And this will be this wire and it has this special end on it. Now moving to number six, this is your black two white tracer and this is your coil positive terminal and that will be this wire right here. Now moving down the wire to number seven, your last point on this harness, and that right there is your red three white tracers, and this is your voltage regulator slash battery terminal. And that will be the general idea of where all these connections go on your harness. The first step is to install your number one wire on to your light switch. And this is your red wire with three white tracers and it'll connect to the power terminal on your light switch, which is the stud on your guys's far left. And it's the very end one. Your red wire with three white tracers then will feed up the dashboard and then connect to your amp gauge and you will connect to the battery terminal on your amp gauge which is the driver's side terminal or on your left side according to the wax four-wheel drive parts electrical diagrams this will now be your number two terminal according to the drawings and now this red wire with three white tracers will now branch off back into the dashboard where your amp gauge will be placed and just follow the same red wire with three white tracers and now that will feed through your firewall. From your right side harness you can see that there's actually one more cable that comes out the other side facing towards you and it's a black cable with two white tracers and this wire will be fed to your keyed ignition switch. Now with the black wire with the two white tracers that's coming out of your main harness, this last wire will be connected to the keyed ignition switch on the back side here and you will tighten it on to the ignition part on your keydick switch make sure you install this wire on the right labeled section it is now a good time to connect the other wire to your keyed ignition switch and that wire will be connected to the battery terminal on your keyed switch and this will be your black wire with the two white tracers and this is a very small wire and it'll feed up through the back on your dashboard that small black wire will be connected from this terminal to your amp gauge and it will be connected 
to the battery terminal or the driver's side or left side of your amp gauge. Also coming from your main harness here is also a black cable with three white tracers and that will be fed through your dashboard and connected to your amp gauge on the load side which is the passenger side or your right side. I am now on the engine bay side of the Willys Jeep and that harness will come through the firewall and there should be three wires that will come through and make sure you use a rubber garment and it comes through this hole as the wires are cut for this specific location. The black cable with the three white tracers will be connected to the battery side on your foot pedal, which will be located where my finger is. And this wire right here, this black wire with two white tracers will connect to your ignition coil, which would be on the engine. And finally, this wire will directly connect to your alternator, which will be located approximately right here. Part two of the engine bay wiring of your right side harness will follow next. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe. Mm -hmm.